Good morning, guys. I think that's my car. We got a lot of snow last night. We gotta start digging out first thing this morning. You guys should come join us, won't you? Well, looking at that picnic table over there, looks like what, maybe 15, 16 inches? We'll have to measure. That's a lot of snow, at least a foot. Man, and it's drifting and it's blowing and it is cold out. It's pretty low. Very pretty. Well, the good news is, just as we were getting ready to shovel, I got a text message saying they canceled all our shifts at work. Kristen's uh, place also closed today too. So that's good because Lincoln's daycare also closed today too. So everything's closed. Uh, the whole area shutting down. I kind of want to get a ruler or something, go out there and see how much snow we got. But at the same time, I don't. Uh, we're going to wait on shoveling and then we'll figure out how much we got once we get out there and shovel. It's so sad. The tree's coming down. Uh, we got all the ornaments off. That took quite a while. Uh, but now we're going to take a break because I think we're going to go outside and start, start shoveling snow. Probably one of many sessions because it's uh, at least 12 inches deep. Yeah. Lincoln is in like four layers. No, oh, three layers. And he, he's trying to learn how to walk in three layers. Yeah, we're gonna go play in the snow. Okay, now that it's a little bit more daylight out, you can see how exactly high the snow is, especially on that picnic table. Yeah, not too bad around the garage, but as it gets back, it drifts. That's gotta be like almost two foot there, that drift. Oh, it's a big drift in the middle of the drive too. Oh man. This is going to be fun. Uh, definitely not going to get this all done in one shot. Not with a shovel. Lincoln, are you cutting the snow with your lawnmower? Yeah. Are you cutting the snow with your lawnmower? Yeah. Well, we made it out to the picnic table. The picnic table said we had 11 inches of snow. Uh, the car, according to the car, we had 12 inches of snow. So we're going to call it 12 inches. Uh, but where it drifts, it drifts a lot higher. Uh, we're making slow, slow progress. But yeah. we are making progress. I have a feeling as soon as we get done like around the car, we're going to clean the car off. We're going to have to do all the way around the car again. Boo. Well, that is not me out there shoveling the driveway. And that is not Kristen out there shoveling the driveway. We got about a quarter of the way done. Your arm started hurting from where you injured it a couple weeks ago. Uh, yes, I did injure it a couple weeks ago. My cold started acting up again. This gentleman drove by, said, hey, why is my camera fogging? It's so cold outside, it's fogging. This guy came by and said, hey, I'll do it for 25, I'll finish everything for you. We said, sold. Uh -huh. Because, hurts so bad. yeah, I'm tired, just doing a quarter of it. And the whole car, which was like doing that section like three times. The tree is gone. We came in, took care of that. You hit your finger. You Little your boy is body. playing. Yeah, so we're just letting him take care of business. Well, he did a great job on the driveway. Thank goodness he uh, came around and was just trying to make a little bit of extra money. So I figured, why not let him do it? Save my back, save Kristen's arm, save me from getting sicker than I already am. But I'm glad it is all done. Time for dinner. And what better to have on a cold, snowy day than grilled cheese? Maybe some tomato soup for Kristen? I don't know. Looks delicious, though. Uh, and I cannot wait to have these. Kristen actually went out and bought bread after the driveway was cleared just so we could have these today. So kudos to her. Cannot wait for my grilled cheese sandwich. Mm, 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 mm. Those are looking delicious. Man, I'm a master of grilled cheese. Man, that was delicious. It's been a while since I had a good grilled cheese sandwich and that one was super delicious. Now, uh, I know we only like shoveled a quarter of the driveway, maybe a third of the driveway, but I'm exhausted from it. I am super tired from doing it uh, and I gotta get up super early. So here's what I think we're gonna do. We're gonna cut the video here 
we're gonna call it a day uh, storm cleanup and tearing down a Christmas tree a lot of work uh, I'm gonna make myself a Rupert float one of my favorite drinks non-alcoholic drinks because uh, as you guys know I'd love myself a pina colada and a Jack and Coke uh, I'm gonna get a piece of cake that we made yesterday I'm gonna sit down I'm gonna eat some cake enjoy Rupert float watch a little bit of YouTube and then go to bed early I mean it's only 8 15 I'm probably gonna be in bed by like before 9 o'clock and turn around and get up early tomorrow because I still want to give myself enough time to get to work tomorrow the roads are still gonna be a little iffy in the morning because I think it's supposed to snow a little bit more tonight less than an inch but a little bit more tonight so yeah we're gonna call it a day uh, thank you for joining us uh, I'm not sure what's going on tomorrow we'll see uh, we'll see what happens maybe more cleaning up of Christmas stuff I, I, I really couldn't tell you but you'll know when I know so I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye, guys.